guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Letitia Charisma. If you guys are new here, this is The K-Squad, where we talk about all things wigs, baby. And on my TikTok and Instagram, I give little beauty reviews here and there, as well as tutorials. Go ahead and follow me on both, as well as subscribe here and hit that thumbs up button. Let's go ahead and jump right into Today, we're gonna be talking about the Sensational Texture Lace Wig Kinky Edges. 13 by 6 kinky natural wave, 14 inch. I have her in the color number two. This is not out on wig websites yet, but by the time this review goes up, I'm sure she'll be out pretty soon within the next week or so. So keep your eyes out for this. Shout out to Sensational for sending me this gorgeous unit. Let's go ahead and get into it, you guys. So I was really on the fence about reviewing the very first drops from the um, kinky natural edges, well, the texture lace wig kinky edges. Um, um, little thing here because when I looked at the edges, I'm like, okay, that's not my hair type. So I have a 3B curly hair type. My hair is very, very curly. And I really, honestly, I don't like to even classify my hair as that because I'm old school and me coming up, we didn't do that. It was either you had kinky hair, nappy hair, curly hair, straight hair, thick hair, whatever. It, I have never in my life Heard of 3B, 3C, 4C, none of that until, you know, a few years ago when they were classifying hair. Now, that's just my own personal opinion, but when I describe my hair, I don't describe my hair as that, okay? A sister just got some curly ass hair. Anywho, so I was on the fence about reviewing those, so I did not. But when I did get this one, I looked at the edges and I'm like, you know what? You could definitely lay those edges down, you know, with like a little toothbrush or whatever you do with your gel and all that, you know, your uh, your edge your edge gel, whatnot. So I'm like, okay, I see where they were going with this. I do love that it's also a 13 by six and that you can pretty much part her anywhere. You can flip it left, right, up, down. I do appreciate that they did that. So shout out to Sensation Nail for even going there. And I also noticed here on the stock card that this says for curl types 3B and 3C. So that was right up my alley when I got this in the mail because I'm like, okay, at least it is you know, gonna look similar to my real hair. So I decided, you know what, I'm just going to wear my real hair out on the unit. And I'm so glad that I did. It looks so, so, so natural. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. You guys, two combs in the front, one comb in the back with your adjustable straps. It also comes with that really great elastic wide band back there. My head is a small peanut sized head, but this fits small and big head girls. But for us smaller head girls, you guys are definitely gonna have to kind of adjust some straps back there, you know, have your combs, because it does run a bit big for us peanut head girls. But nonetheless, it still fits nice and snug, as long as you adjust everything back there. Now, as far as this texture and density is concerned, this is a natural density. Me having curly hair, trust me, I know. And this is a very natural density. You do feel tracks going throughout it, but that's because it's curly hair, but you don't see the tracks. So I'm cool with that. And I do love that it is a 14 inch unit, very short, which means it is great for the summer. This is so, 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 so lightweight. And I think that the texture is great too. Very soft, yakky texture going on. Very, very soft, hands are going right through her. As far as tangling and shedding, I did get a bit of shedding, but I think that's because I cut the lace and the edges off of the unit, you guys, in order for me to wear my real hair out. But other than that, I didn't really get any. So I don't think there's gonna be too many tangles or too much shedding going on with this unit as well. I am decided to go ahead and flip the hair to the left and just leave my real hair out. I'm also gonna go ahead and like kind of zoom in so y'all can take a look at my hair and you know, you can decipher for yourself how natural everything looks but i think it came out absolutely gorgeous you guys i just am in love with this unit i just love how it flows it has great body on it as well like you can shake it and all that good jazz and like i said you can just style this however because it is a 13 by six frontal. And this is also heat resistant fiber safe up to 400 degrees, but I really don't think you're gonna be putting any heat to this, but I mean, you know, it's your wig girl. You do what you want with your wig, okay? Um, it does say here that the kinky edges 
will match your hair like your hair type or whatnot and i did notice with the lace it's very 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 transparent so you definitely can go in with your powder or whatever you use to kind of blend if you're not going to wear your real hair out um on this unit it's very very meltable as far as the colors with this unit um it comes in really natural colors you guys hl 28044 hl 4451 m44 um 2730 and then th2 copper i would suggest to get this unit in a natural color that's just my opinion but i think the natural colors would help it look more natural you, you guys understand what i'm saying y'all have no idea how hungry i am like i got up i started washing i started filming i fed my cat i cleaned up a little bit and i haven't ate nothing i ain't ate nothing a sister is hungry when i'm done filming this baby i am going to go eat y'all don't know oh yeah and on top of that i'm on my period so yeah like it's just a great day for me at least i'm cute though at least i'm cute anywho but girl yeah let's go ahead and get into this install so the install was really simple i did cut the lace and the edges off of the unit Went in with a little bit of my Anastasia Beverly Hills powder just to kind of blend that lace there, even though you're not going to see it, but I still wanted to blend the lace because even with my hair out, you could still see the lace. That how, that's how light the lace was, right? So I wanted to make sure that I blended as well as possible. I also used a black wig cap for this look as well. And all I did was, you know, kind of just flip it. I went ahead and took my hair out, wet it, curled it up a little bit with a bit of leave-in conditioner, went in with some um, edge control gel like around my edges there, and of course I had to spray her with my Tresemme hairspray. Girl, like, girl, you already know I'm going to use that, but I didn't spray her to the 80s this time. I sprayed it like to 2000 and maybe seven because I still wanted it to kind of flow, kind of move, be able to put my hands through her, but still stay where it needs to stay. So all in all, I was in the mirror not even maybe 10 minutes and I was out the door even if you're not going to wear your real hair out on this unit it's the same thing this is definitely going to be a headband unit as well you guys already know I love my polka dot headband and that's my Aaron wig right you know you just put the headband on go about your business so I, I love that it's also going to be a headband wig you can also add mousse to add volume to the unit as well even though the volume is really great as far as the density is concerned but you definitely can go ahead and add mousse to this as well so yeah not in the mirror 10 minutes honey i was out the door being that this isn't up on big websites i have no idea what the price range for this is going to be but i'm assuming it's going to be in the same price range as the other um kinky edge texture lace wigs which wasn't bad at all those wigs were so gorgeous and i'm also so excited about the other styles that are about to drop and i'm definitely going to be talking about that in my what's new and sensational drops later on in the week but this one definitely ate as far as the pros and the cons are concerned the only con i would say is that it is it's a little bit too big for my head like it's not peanut head girl friendly and you're definitely going to have to adjust those straps and those combs if you really want her to stay and then as far as the lace is concerned it is a bit light like really really light so you're going to have to put in a little bit of elbow work just to get that to blend but other than that the pros are definitely going to outweigh the cons it's a great unit for the summer it's very versatile being that it's a frontal you can wear it as a headband wig you can cut it you can flip it you can part it, it it's so versatile so i definitely am feeling miss uh kinky natural wave 14 you guys when this does come out i will go ahead and link the website that's going to come out on but just for further notice i get most of my wigs from um so good bb.com they're had they have really fast shipping i'm in the houston area i don't know where, they, where you guys are but sometimes it just takes a day for the units to get to my home so if i were you guys i would definitely continue to check so good bb.com i'm going to link it down in the bottom description box below and yeah, you guys, when this comes out, go pick her up. That's pretty much it for this review. If you enjoyed my content today, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button as well as sub to the K-Squad right now. Don't forget to follow me on TikTok and Instagram at Leticia Charisma for more beauty and hair-related content. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay beautiful and blessed. Bye.